like subscribe and get notified there has been an assault on indian democracy our accounts have been frozen since last more than one month since last around five weeks or so we have been unable to utilize our own funds in the bank you'll be surprised to know that a case income tax case pertaining to 2017 18 which is seven years back on that basis income tax has served us notice for 210 crores 25 lakh rupees that amount of lien is was marked against the congress party in all our accounts and effectively we were unable we are unable to utilize our 285 crore rupees our own money which is lying in the bank the most important thing is the timing and the exemptions which all the political parties enjoy. When all political parties enjoy income tax exemption, then why is it being slapped on the Congress party? Never it has happened in the past that the BJP had to pay any kind of penalty, any kind of income tax. Then why is it con why that the Congress party being singled out? The timing is such that seven years old case it seems that the BJP was waiting for the elections to come and just one month before the elections were to be announced, they froze our accounts. So imagine how can it be a level playing field? We don't have money to give to our candidates. We don't have money to publish our pamphlets. We don't have money to have organize our public meetings. We don't have money to book advertisements in the social media or in the newspapers. So how are we going to fight the elections or how is democracy still alive in the country where the principal opposition party is unable to spend even a single penny in the elections. And it is not only this, the government has not stopped only on this 2017-18 notice. We have been slapped with another notice last week and it pertains to 1994-95 during Sitaram Kesri when he was the treasurer. So imagine we are being slapped with a notice, income tax notice. 30 years back pertaining to account 30 years back and just at, at the eve of election so that we are unable our accounts are crippled and we are unable to use our own money for the elections so please this is the time when it is not only fight for the congress party our own fight alone it is we have to all fight together to save democracy the income tax act section 234f allows maximum penalty of rupees 10,000 for late submission of income tax returns maximum penalty of 10,000 rupees but on the contrary congress party has been slapped a penalty of 2,210 crore rupees against the violation of just 14 lakh 40 thousand which we deposited in cash and 30 days delay so the quantum of punishment is totally unmatched with with a trivial uh, small time small kind of uh, mistake you may say or small kind of thing which has been done in seven, then seven years back which can easily be condoned watch on herald tv